Alright, what's good? It's me, Jay. Today I'm going to show you basically using your computer as like an effects processor or effects board, whatever you want to call it. So today I'm going to be using my my Modiex uh, synthesizer as the example. So right now, if um, I have monitoring on on my um, my interface, so anything I play is what you're gonna hear, um, just like basically before I run effects through it. Now, come into your um, audio interface, and if it has a monitoring switch, basically flip it off. So when you play it. Uh, you won't be able to hear anything but for me for example I have it running through three and four so I will just uh, turn monitoring off on on three and four which is my stereo input for the keyboard so now I won't hear anything come into your DAW of choice uh, for me it's Ableton set up an audio channel and whatever you're trying to get affected uh, just create that and for me it's three and four so audio from three and four and where you're gonna do it right here is monitoring on the DAW so if I flip monitoring to on or should I say in monitoring in now I'll be able to hear it okay let's put a reverb on at full mix effects processor y'all have a good day really hope this helped I really wasn't able to find too much help on the internet kinda just figured this workaround out myself and I know to some of you guys this may be pretty like self-explanatory or like simple but I know a lot of people are in question on how to do it. So anyways, y'all have a good one. Like and subscribe if this helped. And uh, thanks for watching.